So we're going to come over here and we're going to generate, and we're going to say 50 of these images, and it's going to start prompting these style codes. And you can check this out. That is a really cool style code that we got our first shot. And now it's going to start populating them here for you. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find amazing mid-journey style references that takes mid-journey and turns it into a completely different image generator just by putting in a single style reference. I'm going to show you how to find these and I'm going to show you a tool that can automate this process for you as well as a few websites that you can find even more. So stay tuned. The first way of easily finding a style reference, put a period or do some non-object specific keyword. Yes, no, community. All of these are single word, remain, task, very simple single word prompts. They all might come out looking pretty abstract, but the style truly shines through. So you don't have to try to imagine what the style is. Mid journey is going to let you know right up front. Do a period or let's just say community and we'll say style reference and we'll say random and it's just going to choose one. And you can now take this and you can apply anything you want to it photo of girl in garden and there we go it is in the style of this and it's a girl in a garden bam 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 and there's another way you can scale this you would go in and you do the same thing we'll say style reference random and what this is this is repeat it's going to generate any number of images that you put in here we're just going to say 10 and here we go we have 10 running simultaneously bam that's really cool this is an amazing anime one i can't get enough of these things this is how you can quickly add to your own library and then you'd want to organize it you would come in here and you'd say something like style references click on smart folder and we'll put in community create folder now anytime you want to find a style reference you can go into your smart folder and easily find the ones that you want to use delete all the other ones that you don't want and then you have a way to quickly find your style references now we're going to go into a few different websites first one is my website link will be in the description below this is pretty straightforward you have all of your styles over here. There's a lot of them. Futuristic portraiture, some really cool futuristic neo sci-fi. And then you could copy this, go back over to mid journey, put that in. We'll say girl on rooftop looking over city. So let that create. We'll clear those filters. You could also base it on colors. Here's beige, some beige colors. There's some beige in there. There's some beige found in there. These are the images that it created off of that style that we found on my website, the futuristic one pretty cool you can also do recent uploads i upload these every single day sometimes a hundred or more every single day there you go check those out some more updates will be coming soon the next one is dream prompts similar to my website you can go to all style codes you can come up here they have a pretty unique way of searching so you say abstract take it down say no abstract it's going to be less abstract you can click on those it'll bring up some other ones that have a similar color click on these you get some tags you can get a bit of information on the style itself next one is style reference hunter these are all twitter accounts that put these out it has some information about it and then other mid journey codes and this is style reference hunter dot top then we have mid journey style reference dot com Photography, 92 style reference codes and prompts to create photography art styles. That is really cool. That's a really cool one. Yeah, I really like these on this site. These are pretty dope, not gonna lie. This is, this is killer check prompt yeah let's check that prompt okay this is where they get you with the money so they do give you the style and then they give you some really cool images and then they hit you with that 20 bucks and you get all the prompts not something i'm gonna do but that is pretty dope man those are cool yeah this is some og stuff right there they did a really great job mixing the style and the prompts let's go to the next style safari 60,000 entries i really like how they have set up it's very similar to mine results for modern i'm sure that this this is looking at the description so if I go to description it's gonna have modern in there yeah modernist then you can go over here you can search for signatures similar to that style reference those have some number of similarities in them it has the palette which is really cool lots of keywords 
a detailed description. I really like it. And this is just called Style Safari. Now I'm going to jump into the tool that I created for you to actually do this yourself. Automates this entire process. This tool is something that is used locally. It's stored on your computer. Pretty simple to run it. You go into the folder and you do a simple command and it'll run this entire process for you. Head over to localhost. You just copy and paste that and you're going to be greeted with this simple dashboard. So we're going to come over here and we're going to generate and we're going to say 50 of these images and it's going to start prompting these style codes and you can check this out. That is a really cool style code that we got our first shot and now it's going to start populating them here for you. You can take them and you can process them into a PDF based on each of these images. It takes the image, it gets the color palette and it will create separate slides for each of your images that you create into a slide. Use this to store a bunch of really cool style codes. You can then share these across social media in a really nicely designed way. If you have some really, really cool ones that you found, it's going to format the specific slide to really make this color pop. The blood color perfectly blends together with the blood. Beautifully done. And this is all done by AI. So you will need an open AI key in order for you to to get this part working. All you have to do is be a member of my Patreon and then you get this entire code directly to you where you can automate this. That's how I find really amazing styles like this one. And you could easily just do this while you sleep. 100, 200, generate images. The Patreon is linked below. It's only $10 a month. You get access to this tool. You'll get access to all the tools that I create. My goal is to create a new tool every week for people to use. This is this week's tool. I created another tool last week which you can find here and I uh, suggest you go check that out thank you guys so much for watching I will see you next time